Residents will have their chance tonight to weigh in on a plan to build a new hotel and retail space as part of a new dressage complex already under construction. Now, that plan's met some community opposition and now faces a new threat from a lawsuit filed by a neighbor. In a story you'll see only on 5, News Channel 5's Ryan Calhoun shows you why the neighbor's gone to court to try to stop the whole thing from being built. The foundation is in place for an indoor arena and a 96-acre equestrian village on South Shore Boulevard in Pearson Road. The developer, Mark Bellissimo, says it will be a world-class dressage facility. Wellington was architected many years ago as sort of a private playground for the wealthy. And our fundamental goal has been to change that and to turn it into an industry. That's been approved by the village. What hasn't been approved yet is a new hotel and retail shops. That's up for public debate Wednesday. So that hotel is going to represent an economic engine that's going to bring hundreds and hundreds of jobs to Wellington. And I did not buy my house on this street to look at a strip mall. Kimberly Jacobs lives in the country club behind it. Tuesday, she filed a lawsuit against the village of Wellington, and the company's building the whole facility. The suit says that the new facility violates its allowed elevation, which poses flood problems. I bought my home with the expectation that I wouldn't have to worry about it being flooded come rainy season. You filed a lawsuit? Yes. What's your hopes to do with that? My hope is to make them slow down. Let's just slow down and explain to me how this isn't going to impact what my, my expectation was when I bought my home on the street. Despite this suit and Wednesday's hearing, the developer expects to bring his full plan to Wellington. I think the vast majority of people are excited about this. I think there's a small group of people that are well-funded that are not excited about it because they have what they need to, to pursue their lives. If you'd like to weigh in on the discussion, there will be a public hearing tonight at 7 o'clock at the Village Chambers. For now, in Wellington, I'm Ryan Calhoun, WPTV, News Channel 5.